Thank you, Mr. President. Before she's a woman, she's a girl. And what happens to her at that critical juncture of adolescence, as you said, determines not just her future, but the future generations. That's the girl effect. So the organizations of this cluster are putting girls at the center of their strategies. The first is Margaret McGlynn of Merck Vaccines and Pair Shots of Kyogen. They are launching cervical cancer vaccination, testing, and treatment for three million girls and women worldwide. Next is Rhonda Mims of ING and Joyce Roche of Girls Incorporated. ING staff mentors girls in managing real-time investment portfolios. All investment gains go toward college education for girls. And Elizabeth Scharf of Sustainable Health Enterprises. This commitment gives health education and sanitary pads to one million girls and women in Africa, allowing them to stay in school and work during their menstrual cycle and lead healthy lives. And Ahuma Adadoji of Plan USA. Plan's commitment provides job skills training in media production for girls in Ghana and educates local media on the pressing issues of girls, building on their pioneering awareness raising work with Because I Am a Girl. And Christine Pearson of the Free Play Foundation. Free Play is tackling energy poverty through self-powered lights, radios, and educational radio programs for 20,000 girls in Rwanda. And Henrietta Kolb, director of the Cherie Blair Foundation for Women, and Hani Masri of Tomorrow's Youth Organization. Together, they are supporting young Palestinian women-led businesses for female university students in the West Bank. And the Novo Foundation and the Nike Foundation, with the Center for Global Development and the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, are launching Start with a Girl, a new agenda for global health. And the Grameen Healthcare Trust, under the leadership of Dr. Mohammed Yunus, is launching the Grameen Nurse Institute to revolutionize rural health care in Bangladesh. I'll take that. There we go. I want to thank all these participants. We are increasingly, the last two years, we try to cluster these commitments together so they reinforce one another. And I'm very grateful to Maria for the extraordinary effort she made to help put all this together, too.